How do you how do you even see in these? Everything's so dark. Oh, there's a key and and there's some <laughs> things on the table and uh... Hi YouTube, Guild Mouse here and Guildmaster Dan. Hi. And he's gonna introduce the game because I'm gonna mess it up anyways. Oh, there are. I'm Guildmaster Dan, and I this is Guild. That. <laughs> I know you <laughs> told me to do I'm doing the open intro. Well, anyway, welcome back to Let's Play Telltale's Games: A Game of Thrones, Episode One, because Episode Two is actually coming out pretty soon. We'll probably continue on into that for Guild Month. Um, anyway, so I think that's a dagger, or it could also be a letter opener. You know what? This? Yeah, that. This is Tyro family, family seal. seal. But first oh, it's we're a, gonna... oh, it's a seal. But first we're okay, gonna... seriously, I can't see in these. I would take Ow. these. Ow! You yoinked my ear. Okay, well, anyway. Let's go. Pick it up! Key? Why are we sneaking keys? What is this even to? Return, return it or take it. It's a big life changing. There's no return time. Return it? What is it even to? Return it? Yeah, put it back. Oops. What is it even to? We don't even know what we're taking. It's probably somebody's chastity belt. The Who seal? Knows? Examine. Examine. We can look at it. Oh, this is so, like, we could write letters and, uh, seal. I don't think that's our seal. No, that's, that's, uh, Marjorie's. Oh. But we're not in a position uh, where we have to do something like that. Uh, I think those were the only two. What? No. Ah, uh, we can pick it up. Eh? Eh? And then we have the option to take it or keep, or Do we it have back. to take stuff? Do we have to? We'll put it down. Oh, All right. right. Do we have to do anything? Does why are, why are we trying to take things? We're not that yeah. girl. She's Lady the Marjorie ambitious still one. with the king. I thought you'd want to know. Who did? Thank you. She's still with the king. Oh. Mira, look. The other day when you asked Lady Marjorie for help, I only spoke out of fear for her. I want to help you if there's anything I can do. I don't Your poor you. family. I can't imagine Thank how you, you must feel. Me. You're sweet to offer, Sarah. Thank you. Lady Marjorie is always saying how important friends and allies are in King's Landing. Just yeah. know, I will be here for you <laughs> if you ever... Oh, not happy. Why is it every time I come in my room, you two are sitting? <laughs> my lady, I'll leave you to Get talk. Get to work. Oh, you just got kicked out? No, she left. Is everything all right? What did he say? How was dropping? Is everything all right? Bup, bup. Are you all right, my lady? You look pissed at me. The for. king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Oh. I'll need this mended. Gods. He said I was too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I allayed his fear. For now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. Nothing I said could cheer him. He wouldn't even to speak help? to me when I left him. What can I do to make this better, my lady? There's nothing you can do, Mira. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. You can do something for me. Is that what you're going to say? This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, my lady. Oh, so I should have backstabbed you and went to Tyrion. Soon I will be queen. We could still and do maybe that. then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. I didn't say you could leave! Yeah, that's a legit point right there. Now who are you gonna meet in the hall? Tyrion? Face claim time! Milady. Oh, cool kid. Begging your pardon, milady. It's I hope I didn't frighten you. you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, milady. I hope you saw. I was right before. About Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know, I I can help you if you'd like. And your family, if you're willing to trust me. I, think I hear all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. 
You need allies. Hopefully I've proven I could be useful to you. I'm sorry. I... I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... Red? People who'd be willing to help you. Who's coming? Oh, just a just guard. Just a guard. I thought it was gonna be someone cool like Jamie or something. Nah. He should be in King's Landing right he now with Brienne. should be Cersei in pointy, sh like, pointy gold boots. <laughs> pointy clinking shoes. Who that? Oh, no. Have you noticed all guards seem to be douches? Oh, that's okay. They all, like, stare his, at you and stuff. His clothing was glitching through his butt. His butt was glitching through his clothing. Like, they all so. seem to be butting in into all the ladies. Where's Sir Roiland? Oh. He should be Tell here. Him. Oh, damn, right to the nitty-gritty. The man values pride more than honor. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us. But I'm confident we have enough strength him. of our own. These ravens Your men best. stand ready to act if needed. We will prevail? We will prevail. Our plan is a good one. It will work so long as everyone does their part. Oh, it's the... It's the fat guy. Oh, come on. If anybody Isn't needs to be turned a into a suit, it's him. him. Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. <laughs> nice thing. Ironwood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is he? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roose Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of Thank the you. Warden no. of the... That's enough. Ooh, Treat play him off that. like royalty. Who is this little boy? Welcome, Lord Ramsay. Is he lost? Lord Ramsay, welcome to Ironrath. Aren't you the little lord? Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this. Look at you. Are you baby talking me? A token for the new warden of the north. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Mm -hmm. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. Don't you approve? Or Don't know what's so special it? about it. Your father will appreciate it, I hope. Our Ironwood is highly sought after. My father is not so easily impressed. <laughs> not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not oh. this. Rendered apparently. face. Yeah. Look at that. Nope. War Forester. Lord Ramsay. Come out where I can see you. He's got to size you up for some suits. <laughs> <laughs> we really oh. must focus oh, on the on business the at hand. You want our fealty? Leave them be. What do you want? You want our fealty? Lord Ramsay, I understand you've come here for assurance of our fealty. Fuck fealty. We came here for justice. We'll get to your justice. Oh. First. We have Ramsay's attention. Let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Present Bolton, your father. Warden of the North. Words are wind. Anyone can uh, say eh, they're loyal. Eh, eh. I want you to show me. My lord. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, was it? Yes, it was. My joints have cracked and... Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. The crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the king. At you the wouldn't same want to make him a liar, that Starks paid. would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. Your father needn't worry? Yeah. You needn't worry. Your father will have what he needs. That's a good little lord. You can't trust her, Forrester. They murdered our men. It was a Forrester squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Mistaken, Yet your man he was, justified. he was within his right. They killed his family. His right? He killed a loyal soldier in my father's army. 
Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence what? from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Text Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? Wait, what? The Ironwood. But... That is our livelihood. Then you'd better well find another fucking job. You can't you do that. <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We do. We are talking about trees. We are true craftsmen. You grow them. You cut them down. We are true craftsmen. We have loyal craftsmen who make the finest weapons. The White Hills have no such craftsmen. Do you want yeah. ironwood for the next five years? Or the next 50 generations? The little lord does have a point. Yep. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men <gasps> within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan. They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. This will cause, this more, will trouble. cause more trouble, not less. <laughs> not for me. True. We can't support a garrison of 20 men. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Ball Riff head. will lead the garrison. Ball cut. You have no right. White Hills have no place here. Lads, do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Duncan, don't. Look at this little forester. Nope. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Ah, oh, twins. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. <laughs> hmm. Nice jibe. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. We have more to discuss? We have more to discuss. We have more to discuss, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. Nope. You can be my highborn ward. Lord Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. Take me instead? We'd get along well. well grab Talia or let her go. <laughs> I suppose you can stay. Oh, good. Aren't you the bold lord? Oh, oh, Ethan! Oh, got me killed! We, he was gonna kill us anyway. But no. I don't want a bowl, no. <laughs> Far too much trouble. Ethan! Ethan! No! 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 Even though he did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. Lord Ethan! I certainly feel better about all this. He's what have you done? Yep. However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Eh. Nope. Baby, protect me outside! Take the blade of your wolf. No! Kill him. Thank you for any trouble. Brian! Lovely meeting all of you. No, I might have shared this one again sometime. Somebody help him. Fetch the mace so quickly! You brought this on yourself. No, we didn't. Please. Stop! Did we die? Are we actually Yes, dead? we died. And that's the end of the episode. Is it? Is yeah, because died? there's no way anybody expected that, so it's got to be the end of the episode. Unless no, we're... I expected it, because you know what happened? You got within arm's distance of him. Specifically, Ramsey. Yeah. Yeah, your story has begun next time. You just Game killed me! How is my story beginning? It's us, not him. Either Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. 
He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forester above all other loyalties. Mm. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again. Oh, that's Asher. Our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? Good things you're not gonna ask us to kill anyone. You're stabby, Tyrion. Stabby, stab. You don't believe in assassination. Oh. All right, let's see. What did everyone else say? All right. You and 51%, 51.5, stayed with Bowen. You and 70.6% swore loyalty to the well, king. Well, obviously. What are you going to tell the queen to screw off? You and 38.8 sent Eric to the wall. You and 62% picked Duncan as the sentinel. Well, obviously. He's a nicer guy. I don't know. He's going to lean towards picking him. disagrees. All right, and 61.3% met Ramsey in the Great Hall. Whoa. See, it didn't matter, like, what we did. Ramsey was planning on murdering us. Yeah. I was kind of hoping you would have been like, Ah, oh, you missed the vital thing, and you just cut out my vocal cords. Oh, no, at least killed him, you know, because this is Game of Thrones. It's known for killing off characters. Well, I guess it was time. You, you wouldn't be... Ex we did go, like, I a mean, whole episode without somebody dying. And after playing through Walking Dead, I mean, you, could, you, you can expect Telltale to kill off characters, mm. but... Um, you don't expect him to kill off the main character so well, early. Even we just, the main character. We just spent this whole time playing this game, right? Yeah. In the time of the first episode, we just sent two people to the wall. You know what we're doing? We're fortifying the wall! Oh, well, yeah, that's <laughs> what you're supposed to do. We're gonna for continue to fortify you know, the wall. Screw the rest of the kingdom, fortify the wall. Because the wildlings are trying to break through, and, you know, white walkers and junk and yeah. stuff. And I don't remember them having a rule about not being able to like send money back to your family they have or even well no stuff. you don't have your own money you're provided by the wall and yeah that guy we sent off to the wall should kind of be happy a little bit he'll be fed at the wall yeah but his, he'll know, get his three meals his a day his wife and stuff are gonna die oh we'll take care of them or they'll marry somebody else that's the only problem well, with these choice systems is you know it doesn't give you the choices that you would make in real life just because um, People assume. I mean, just because we sided with Duncan. Three things to say. Well, yeah, just like, because we sided with Duncan Meh. didn't mean we couldn't present a like an attitude of strength, make ourselves. We look didn't strong. like. It's not like we didn't want some of the guards standing in the room. To yeah, maybe seriously. Keep him yeah, from seriously. I mean, oh, sure, we'll just let twenty guys walk in. I mean, come on. Oh, Granted, but no, you were paying attention, right? Yeah. He did get stuck waiting outside the gate. Yeah, well, even well, though we, we said, said not, not to, well, he still ended up waiting. That's that illusion of choice yeah. thing, where and that like Ramsey would have killed us no matter what. <laughs> it, but it's why did why did the credits did freeze? It break? No. Oh, oh, we gotta like sign in, cancel. cancel? All right, Maximize listen. your game of ah, okay. experience. Well, anyway, that that was episode one. Uh, episode two will be coming out soon. Probably by the time you watch this video, it should actually be out. Stop that. I'm break dancing. You're not break dancing. With, with the with, mouse. That's not break dancing. You're just making noise. Oh uh, well. And mm -hmm. does that mean we're gonna see uh, Daenerys in the next one? Probably. Either way, it's well, we nice going, art. We are going overseas to go get Asher. Well, all right. Well, all right. Uh, what do you think of the episode then? I think that I gotta see the next episode. Well, yeah. I, I mean, but for me, it's like it seems like we're copying the Starks a lot <laughs> um, because they're like the main family. Our loyalty the... was questioned to the king, and we serve the Starks. This is just fallout from. Well, being no, but, loyal no, to but, the Starks, which but, means the king is like, are you on my side? Are you on my side? Well, no, but you, you hear what side? I'm saying. We're just like the freaking Starks. I mean, that girl is practically Sansa. She's in the same situation. No, no, she's not, because Sansa wasn't a handmaiden. No, no, no. Just because she's a hand, she's still going through the same exact turmoil that Sansa was. Oh, you're a traitor by association, even though you had nothing to do with it. Yeah. Oh, you're allying with Marjorie. Oh, the queen hates your guts. 
Oh no, the queen was actually kind of happy. Yeah, and then Garrett, well, that's because we saw revealed it, and bull, I'm saying bull, Cersei doesn't believe that for a second. Of course she doesn't. <laughs> you saw how unhappy she looked when we said, yeah, sure. Kate. I also think Marjorie lied to us. I think she just tore her own dress and Even said Even if that she stuff. did, we're the ones fixing it. Because Marjorie's a lot smarter than people, like, than yeah. at least the Lannisters gave her credit for. Well, it, Marjorie knows that there's kids like the coal bucket kid wandering around all willy nilly gathering intel. Yeah. Which, by the way, I'm totally gonna be like, yes, I'm, I'm gonna. No. Info. Yes. Trust the oh, kids. Info? Smeared and yeah. cool. I don't know. I feel like he's a way to manipulate us from um, uh, the bald guy. I don't remember his name. The one that has the, the little birds away everywhere. at the end, like oh. Well, no. yeah, but he hasn't <laughs> run away yet. The the purple wedding hasn't it's happened like the yet. The secret keeper. Something like the keeper of secrets. Well, well, that is what he does, but... That's his official job title. No, that's not his official job title. Oh. That's just what he and Littlefinger did. Okay. They were sec They were... But I thought people actually called them by that title. No, 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 no. That okay. was not wasn't his actual Overall, job. Overall, I think this is really interesting because, yes, it follows a similar dynamic that we're used to. Um, it's very similar to the main story in Lord of the Rings. Which and, is uh, engrossing Game of Thrones. still because... Jeez. But first, I accidentally related it to Harry Potter, and then I accidentally related it to Lord of the Rings. Oh, <laughs> people are going to be mad. That's... Good mechanics, though. Finding a bunch of stuff that's relatable, so people get engrossed because they try to figure out how to work it right, into their well, pre-existing geek. Well, no, but here's my problem. It's it's, and it's not even so much a problem. I like it, but it but the story is very similar to what's happening to the Stark characters. Well, that's fine. It's elements we're familiar with. It gives us the opportunity to, instead of like, no, don't do the thing, we can click and tell it to do the thing and then like go back in time and do the other thing if we really Which, want to. Uh, I don't know. I think I think they're just trying to copy the experience in the show. In I don't the see anything wrong with that because the show experience is pretty darn good. Well, yeah, I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it's more of the same. Are you disappointed with what we just played? A little, really? tiny bit. Really? I, I definitely want to keep playing. He's lying. He's, I'm not, he's I'm lying. Not lying. So hard. No, I'm not lying. Uh, just a little bit because well, it's you, really similar. How do you know we're not following another thread in the story from because the actual? Because Telltale writing? made it up. Oh. This is all t they they consulted um, Martin, with, but yeah, right. they consulted. Actually, more importantly, they consulted the guy that Martin goes to to remember all the little details about his universe. Oh. Yeah. So, no, but they totally made this stuff up. Well, that's fine because they consulted the actual. Well, author. I'll tell you what. What do you guys think? Do you think this is too similar to show? Do you think House Forrester is too similar to the story of the? Or does it House not Stark? matter because it's awesome anyways? Yeah, and what he's do you just think? Full of puffery. <laughs> puffery? Puffery. Puffery. You are right. so full well, what of do you guys think? Let us know below what you thought of episode one. Um, and, you know, where do you think this is going to go? I, I'm actually excited to see the Asher play out because yeah. he actually seems kind of rude. Well, he doesn't seem like a carbon copy of other characters in the show. I think they're about to un exile him so he can be the new ruling leader of the house. Well, yeah, but I'm interested to see because he. Doesn't seem the same as other characters. It's kind of sad that they killed a twin. Yeah. That psychic connection is yeah. no longer going to be there. It's just yeah. gone. Yeah. Poor Ethan. We made him a nice guy. Oh, well. <laughs> but, yeah, we let us know what you thought the... down below, and you should be seeing episode, or see us start playing episode soon, too. So, thank you guys for episode watching. Episode too soon. <laughs> I said that. No, you said it backwards. You said it backwards. We're not playing this game. I know we're not playing this game. So, anyway, anyways, we'll see you guys drop next us a time. comment and tell us how much you love us because we're awesome. And we'll see you at episode two. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Keep waving. I gotta turn it off. Keep waving. I gotta turn it off.